What should your testosterone level be? Well, there's definitely a difference between normal and optimal. Normal definitely should depend on age. The scientific studies back this up. So if you're in your 20s, normal testosterone should be greater than 400 nanograms per deciliter. If you're in your 30s or 40s, it should be greater than 350. And if you're in your 50s plus, it should be greater than 300 to maybe 350. There are a ton of studies that back up the fact that if you're abnormally low, so below those cutoffs I just said, you're going to have a higher risk for cardiovascular disease, osteoporosis, metabolic syndrome, or just cognitive decline, and the list goes on and on. So that's why I classify that as normal. However, is it better to be six, seven, eight hundred compared to just in the normal range, say 450? Well, there are a decent amount of studies actually that demonstrate that with increasing levels of testosterone up to six, seven, eight hundred, you're going to have decreasing risk of things such as metabolic syndrome. So lower risk of diabetes, hypertension, obesity, etc. And I think that there's a ton of data to show that testosterone levels of 550 or 600 are superior to 400. However, what about 7, 800 or even 900? Well, I think when you get up to those ranges, it's still going to be more beneficial than the 600. Reason being is there's also a lot of studies that demonstrate that with increasing levels of testosterone up to that 900 point, you're going to have increased muscle building capabilities, increased ability to gain strength. And both muscle mass and strength are highly correlated with longevity and adding years to life. So if you can get your testosterone to the upper end of normal, that 900, that would be the most optimal, but anywhere between 600 and 900, I would say is optimal. Reason I'm saying 1200, 1300 is not optimal is there are also a bunch of studies that demonstrate that anabolic steroid use to get to super physiologic levels of testosterone, that 13, 1400 plus is also associated with increased cardiovascular disease, increased liver disease, et cetera. So stay within that 600 to 900 range and you're gonna be golden for total testosterone.